Hey there, my battlehood friends and fans, and welcome to Parasol Storm. I decided to post another video about this night because I don't usually have a lot of vehicle gameplay to show, and I thought for those people who watch, it could be a little bit boring because all I do all the time is run around with a gun and shoot people, and you know, I don't use a lot of vehicles and I know that I'm aware of that I try to kind of like change that but I'm, I just love being a foot soldier but you know this map I don't usually like to play because I hate how the way how you have to get from flag to flag you have to kind of swim across the water to get to the other island and you can get you're such an easy target you know unless you have a vehicle it takes a really long time to get from one flag to the other and a lot of times I can play a whole match, I can play like a half an hour match and I get three kills because I just don't see any enemies on my way, you know, it's like, or I just get sniped all the time trying to get from one flag to the other. So as much as I love the way this map looks and feels, I don't really like the way it plays. But, you know, once in a while you just get to this flat, to this, um, you know, map, it gets, comes up in the rotation and you know, sometimes I back out and sometimes I'm like, hey, I love the team I'm playing with, so I'm just going to stay in because if I'm in a good team, we we'll most likely have a good chance to win and I can have a good chance to do well. And if I can get a ship or a boat, I'm going to try to get it. And in this case, I was lucky. Sometimes it's really hard to get boats on this map because everyone seems to want to be in a boat of course because you know it's an easy way to get from flag to flag and you can get some really good kills if you're a good driver and i really prefer to be the driver when i'm in a boat because i have two different guns to uh, on my in my arsenal if you're like a passenger and you're on the wrong side of the boat you have a really hard time getting anyone and you probably just get sniped in the back because you're basically a sitting duck. So what I try to do when I'm a passenger, I try to change guns a lot, like from left to right, left to right, to left to right, to make it harder on the sniper to get me. But that only works if you're alone with the driver. If there's other people on the boat, obviously you can't switch the guns. You, you're stuck with the gun you have and if you're on the wrong side, you pretty much are a sitting dog. So I'm like discovering this island over here and I noticed that there are a bunch of people on this island. I mean, I find that kind of weird. Um, I don't know how many they're on, but I think they're just sniping and taking out boats and, and helis and whatnot. And they're basically not really playing the objective. So no PTFO and that's not cool. So I'm here to take them out and, sh and, and show them, you know, teach them a lesson, basically. There seems to be a guy up there too, but he's just too far away. Uh, I don't get anyone and I'm having to get back here, but I'm trying to move. I could just sit still and just try to take them out, but I'm really trying to make it hard on them to take me, including this plane that just tried to take me out. So I know I have to keep moving, but when you move, it makes it much, 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 much harder to aim. And so I'm just trying to see if I can get someone before I move on. And it doesn't look so good right here because I don't really see them. I know they're there, but I don't see them exactly. And I can't go closer, but I'm gonna get a double kill right here. So hopefully there are no more people up there and hopefully they don't have a tactical spawn. But it looks like one of my team members is on there. I just got another guy. So I've got three guys off of that. That's crazy. Three guys sitting on an island, not playing the objective. That's wonderful. I mean, that's not very fair to their team. And uh, I think that's why their team is struggling here to beat us. And um, even though they have a ton of boats here, there's another boat right here somewhere around the corner, I believe. Yeah, here it is. And I have to make sure I can take that one. This because that guy is taking this flag. And thank God I have this infrared side because he's like hiding behind the waves. And that's just amazing. I find that so amazing. And on this map, this, um, you know, the waves and everything, how awesome that looks. And it looks like I'm like hunted by a little boat that's just on my side. And 
I don't see him on the map, which is kind of strange. So I'm trying to kind of go in the other direction because it's really hard to steer the boat when you have this like huge waves going on. Uh, your boat's kind of like doing what it wants a little bit. So I'm still being hit by this little boat. I know I have to take him out, but I also have the big boat here close by still. So I got basically two boats and we take them out. So I'm still being attacked by the bigger boat, which is also behind me. I'm trying to like turn my boat around, but my boat is kind of stuck here and I'm pretty much a sitting dock right now. And I know it, I have to get out of this quickly or I get hit. So I'm trying to get the hell out of the dodge and I get hit by something that I didn't foresee. I did not at all know this guy was hunting me down from the sky. And there's not really much you can do, especially if you're not moving, is such an easy target. But I'm lucky to get back into a boat, but unfortunately I'm not the driver and I'm kind of like on the wrong side right now, or maybe not. So I'm just trying to see. Yes, and I'm actually lucky that he was facing the right side so I could take that guy out. But right now, like I said before, I'm actually on the wrong side so I can barely move to the left side. I can kind of shoot forward and to the right, but not to the left. And if you haven't discovered that yet, you can actually shoot through your boat and get an enemy this way, which is totally unrealistic, but you know, why not take advantage of this while you know, it works? So I helped, definitely helped taking out this guy in front of us and actually avoided that we're, we're being taken down. So every little bit of damage helps a lot if you don't want to be taken down. So now we're on the way again and I'm still on the wrong side and I'm desperately hoping that one of my guys is leaving so I can take over their seat and hopefully be on the right side. I'm not assuming that the driver is going to leave but at least I would like to be on the right side because I just feel like I'm being shot at any minute and that's not a good feeling. And he's like shooting at something right there and I'm not quite sure what it is until I realize it's an LOE and I'm being shot at more and more and more. And even though I don't lose health right now, it's just a matter of time until something is going to give. And so I decided to like just get out and yes, I can get that confirmed it's an LOE. I'm a support person so I don't have anything to take that LOE down at all, but I'm already out of the boat. So I decide to just kind of like see if I can take out some guys and I see that one guy is close by the LOV and outside the LOV on foot so maybe I can take him out. And yes that worked well but I'm being shot out by something and I don't know what it is. I don't know what's shooting me. I don't seem to be able to get away from it and I'm dead. Yeah, this is how it usually works on Parasol Storm. You get shot from so many different angles and you don't know where it's coming from. And, you know, you're just an easy target on that map. No matter where you are, it doesn't really matter. Uh, there is cover, but there is not enough cover. Lots and lots of open spaces. And so this guy is sitting, si sitting still here with his boat. It makes me a little nervous. I know he wants to take the flag, but it's like, just keep moving. Don't sit still because I am an easy target here. So please, something is shooting at us and there's a guy. And I have a hard time keeping my, my gun still. So many things shooting at us. And he is sitting and he bailed and I'm trying to get into the driver's seat. He bailed. Thank God he bailed. Am I stuck? Oh, thank God I'm not. So yeah, it sucks when you're stuck on one of those sand banks. But thankfully I was able to get free and now I want to see if I can do a little bit more damage here before the end of the match even though we're like totally in the lead and they have like two, one, zero tickets left. Yes. Well, that was a lot of fun. If all Paracel Storm matches would go like that, I would like to for more to play this map. But unfortunately, that's not always the case. I hope you enjoyed this and I hope to see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.